All right. Memory chips reset. We ready for the next trial? Все готовы к работе. Мы перепрограммировали серый. Good. We've invested a lot of money in this project with uh, diminishing returns, but I think the recalculations of some of our variables will yield to more interesting results. И как вы думаете, корректировки будут иметь значение? Yep, we tweaked her a bit. Shouldn't be nearly as catastrophic as last time. What could go wrong? Много вещей, зная, что вы начинаете эксперимент. Understood. Computer, initiate project monochrome. It's time to go, no one I know It's a whole new game but still feels the same A new high school now Maybe I'll stand out But probably just fit in With the crowd like I always do Maybe I can be So I'm throwing a little back to school thing up at Northside. If you know what I mean, it's gonna be big fun. But it'd be a hell of a lot better with some fine bitches like you two here. <laughs> Alright, see you there. Yo! What the fuck? Watch where the hell you're going! I I uh so sorry. The fuck is she wearing? I think you dropped this. Oh, uh, thanks. Mm -hmm. Wait, do you know where room 233 is? My first period is there. Take a 45 degree counterclockwise rotation at the intersection of sine 45 divided by tan 90. What? Um, it, if you take the force of your acceleration and find the quotient of your distance traveled by the square root of your centripetal force, you can- Out of the way! Wait! So then I said, um, excuse me? I asked for half frappe espresso latte shot, not a full frappe espresso latte shot. It's like they were trying to make me fat or something. Oh my gosh, Pink, you are not fat. Yes, girlfriend, you a slim thicky. Oh my god, shut up. I'm literally a fugly cow. <laughs> like that thing? Ooh. Thesis. Oh my gosh, what the fuck is that, a gremlin? What color even is that? Like, what are you wearing? My clothes? It's... gray? Gray? Huh. Wow, that's quirky. Love that for you. But, um, nobody's been gray at this school in a very long time. We don't do that here. Ew, OMG, I can't believe a gray just literally tried to talk to us. Just met her and sis is already cancelled. Like, hold on ladies. It's totally okay, she's clearly new. My name is Pink. This is Fuchsia, Magenta, and Salmon. They're skinny legends. You're all... colors? Wow, you really don't seem to understand how things work here, sweetie. I don't? Well, for one, you're gray, which is problematic, but surely you're not planning on staying in those desaturated little rags forever. You'll need to pick a hue. So, who are you? What's your true color? My what? Which one are you? Which one are you? Gotta find your group, gotta find your name. Who do you choose? Gotta find your click, cause you gotta stick with the color you can call your own. Which one are you? Who do you choose? Well, I don't know. I just got here. I I really just need to get to class, so would you guys please help me? What was that? Oh, yikes. We did warn them, though. Tried to be a multicolor? Social suicide, really. <laughs> uh, 
actually, they probably would have been better off with literal suicide. I, I just don't understand. Why can't I be yellow and purple? I just want to express myself. You know the rules, Butterscotch. We don't make them, and we don't break them. Can't say the same for your bones, though. Let them have it, bros! No! Oh. My. God. Was their name really Butterscotch? Like, I get the color thing, but that's kind of a stretch. It, it's... a shade... of yellow. Oh. Nunny! Can I say so? A gray radical. Actually, my name's Ashley- Lamau, Pink, why are you anywhere near this thing? I'm just trying to help it before it's too late. Poor creature. I have a name. A and a gender? Epic! Well, whatever. You are, bro. Take my advice. Find yourself a gnarly spot on the totem pole like me and my broskies. Ha <laughs> ha! Or you'll probably end up with lemon lime here. Nice to meet you, dude. I'm sure we'll get along great after you change your clothes. Get hype! Let's get this bread! Woo! Red, blue, orange, pink. Those are my options. They all seem restrictive. I really feel for you, truly, deeply, I care so, so much, but tough tits, that's our world. You learn to get used to it, so I'll ask you again, sweetie. Which one are you? Which one are you? Gotta find your club, gotta find your crowd, who do you choose? Which one are you? Uh, w w well, wait. There are more than four colors, right? I haven't seen all my options yet. What about the other hues? It's, uh, too bad they're not here right now. And I probably won't ever see them again until much, much later. Damn it. Do 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 I love play rehearsal. Happiness cry. Whenever it starts. It's just so do 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 a Something something. Playing so many parts. Yellow! Yes? While I am cognizant of the strenuous reality that the laborious preparation a thespian must thole in order to put on a feat of monumentally splendiferous theatrical farce, the audiovascular wavelengths laryngetically emanating from your unfeigned venture in cantonation is an onerous obscurity to my resolve. That is, to consummate my comprehension of this novel with the dopamine release of completion. Wow, I didn't know you spoke Latin. You're so talented. You are singing very loud, and I am trying to read. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I am so sorry for being so- Loud. Oh, whoops. So what are you reading today? The Holy Quran. Ooh, ooh, silly willy, you read that yesterday. That was the Torah, and I plan to finish the Bible afterwards. I deeply wish to unearth the cosmic spiritual meanings of the elucidations of the sphere of souls through artistic endeavors in order to finally amalgamate the quintessential puzzle that is existence. Sounds fancy. And boring. But, but mostly fancy. Well, I deeply wish for world peace. Ooh, or for our play to go well. Ooh, or to ban rainy weather. Ooh, or like, wow, is that a butterfly? It is so pretty. You, my chipper friend, are an anomaly. But I have learned there are many mysteries to life. Like, what is that doing in public? Oh. My. Gosh. A gray. It's been so long since I've seen one. The one that was alive anyways. She is so cute! Howdy, I'm Yellow, and in this audition, I'll be playing the part of Happy-Go-Lucky Theater Kid! Welcome to the Prisma Academy of Arts and Humanities. I pray to Allah you unearth your locational niche on our haplessly instituted yet inordinately imposed social stratification pyramid before it is involuntarily thrust upon you. May God be with you. Whoa! She speaks Latin and British? She's so cool. I love this school. I love life. Wee! Well, I, I still haven't met. Join the Earth Club. Save the planet. Reduce, reuse, and stop eating meat. Anyone? 
Come on, Prisma. Seize the means of production. Join the communi- I mean, the Earth Club. <laughs> Holy shit. A gray. Huh. <laughs> Wild. Hey. Hi. Join the environmentalists and stand against the oppressive thumb of the greedy capitalist bureaucrats. We have 100% free trade gluten-free snacks. And edibles. Even for pariahs like you. We pride ourselves on our hashtag inclusivity. Uh, no thanks. I, I just want to know where room 233 is. <sighs> Never mind. Stay woke, sheep. Town with the system. Hug a tree. Save the motherfucking whales! How did I end up in this school? Well, now that you're here, you had better choose a color and choose wisely, love, because you're not getting another. You have to choose. You have to choose. You have to choose who you are. I? We'll see what she finds. She's already met most of the pure hues. It'll be interesting to see how she reacts to the neutral colors. They're most like her. As long as she doesn't become too self-aware like last time, she'll be fine. Remember the variation? <laughs> Yikes. Oh, uh, or remember the time we tried the experiment with letters instead? I always thought Project Alphabet Soup had a nice ring to it. We начать первый блок. Oh, you're right. Almost forgot. <laughs> Computer, start first block. Good morning, Mrs. Cobalt. Isn't today just a great <laughs> Shut day? up. Sit down. Class starts now. Welcome to Psychology 101. Unit 1. Adolescence. Identity. Personality. Lesson one. Hormones and sexual activity. Oh, yeah. Red! Red! What? Oh. The fuck y'all looking at? Girl fine as hell. Profanity, Red. Take your seats. Psst. Was that what porn is? Class has begun. Page ten. Do your work that you won't remember at the end of the semester so I can get my paycheck for babysitting. Yo, dude, you think that gray girl's dead yet? Lamau, I bet five on it. If she hasn't picked one yet, yeah, probably. It's been, what, ten minutes in? Gray's gone. Definitely. Um, no, I'm right here. Oh my god, Gray, you're alive. I love that for you. Oh, and you haven't conformed yet. Love that a little bit less, but you do you, Shister. Um, do you mind though? We're kind of gossiping about you and you're like totally interrupting us. Sorry? You're tardy. Again, terribly sorry. I was trying to find my way to class, but people in the school seem to care more about singing than helping each other. Anyway, I'm glad to meet you. My name's Ash- Lee. Sorry, what is this? Detention on Friday. Shut up! Sit. Ooh, great! Sit next to me! My mom packed me gluten-free goldfish! Ooh! Oh, yellow! So bright and happy! But I'm brighter and happier and have more money, so sit next to me, Gray! What? Why? Seems a bit cliche to join the popular girls on day one. Gray, sweetie, I'm just trying to help you! Plus, if I get you to become pink like the rest of my friends, it'll further prove that we are the superior color. Wow, I love racism. How many times do I have to tell you that this is not a race thing? <laughs> Take the kale out of your vagina. It's blocking your hearing. It's better than listening to you. Pink's right, though. You sit next to yellow, and you might catch the gay. I, uh, I'm actually pansexual. Oh, my bad. You'll catch the big gay. Blatantly fragrant homophobia aside, it would be sagacious to resolve coalescence with a more... Tyrion gradients, Gray. We encompass spiritual awakening of the quintessential Numa. Is everyone just going to ignore the fact that no one actually talks like that? Blue, divide by zero. Error, 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 one, zero, one, one, 
What were we talking about? We're talking about how the obvious choice here is to go green. We have environmental awareness, healthy living tips, weed, 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 medical cannabis for stress and anxiety relief. That's a hell of a lot of words just to say weed. Shut the fuck up or I'll stop being your dealer. This is completely idiotic. Yo! This is a great card. I know you are not What do you know, Blue? You'll meet me. I believe you will not go outside the snap. If you sit next to me, then you'll find you will be in the right place. Next to me, trade your soul for makeup, and you might just wake up in the wrong place. Can't you see? She's superficial. A hoe. It's green, you should go. I'm the right place. Just pick me. I don't want to pick a side. But can't we get along instead? Why can't we just be ourselves? Thoughts like that will leave you dead. Hey, bitch, sit down. Get your ass in my lap. I'm a smash. Let me tap. I'm the right place. Can you blow? I am smart, I am sad, but depression's not that bad, I'm the right place. Uh. Ooh, I like pizza, and acting, and sunshine, and cows, and mommy, and foreplay, and doctors. Wait, no, not doctors. Cause they scare me. Even though I respect their profession. Something's something right place. So let's go! Though you all seem pretty nice. I think I'll stay on my own. Honestly, you're scaring me. Well then, why don't you go home? I'm Britney, bitch. Sit down. I'm the best. You're a whore. I lift weights. I lift more. This is insane. I'm so lost. Join the nerds. Join the church. Get a life. Save the earth. I have a headache. Make it stop. All these pressures and rules to fit in at this school I just want to sit down without being a clown I'm a joke, it's okay, I'm the worst all the way But at least let me sit, I am done with your... <sighs> I don't care where I land I would rather just stand Than be in the right place <laughs> What? Class just started. How is it already over? We spent the whole class arguing over you. Also, time moves by faster in musicals, but I've already done the first three units of homework. I charge two fifty per page. Ciao. You dropped something. Uh, I, I'm sorry. I don't think I dropped. Yeah, you're right. I just wanted a better look at your ass. So, listen up. My buddies and I are throwing a party later tonight, and only the coolest people can come. It's kind of a big deal, but it's completely low-key, you know? It can't be that cool if you're having to invite me, of all people. And what normal teenager seriously wants to party on the first day of the school year? I, um, shut the fuck up. We just need more girls, alright? They don't show up to our fiestas for whatever reason. Maybe because you're literally a flaming douchebag. Watch yourself, bitch! Look, I, Pink's coming, and I know she'll find a way to crucify you if you're not there. And you still look like that. What? does that mean? Holy shit, just be there! Tonight! Or you'll end up like... End up like... End me! Like that! Hey, come back here, little bitch! Where's my motherfucking money? This school... sucks. Tell me about it. H hello Where did you come from? We operate in the shadows and strike when least expected. We are the black people. That sounds... Different. Non-conforming. Edgy as hell, I know. But that's kind of our whole brand. Uh, what's a gray like you doing out in public without a color? For the last time, my name is Ashley. And I'm pretty sure gray is definitely a color. This whole everyone hating me just because of what I look like metaphor is getting annoying. That's the way of life for most of us neutral colors. Neutral colors? Like what? Brown? Tan? 
rumors spread fast. You really are new. Let's just say that natural colors, beige, cream, mocha, all of them are so plain and boring that they don't get any screen time. You'll probably not even see them much until later in the play. Play? Fourth wall breaking? Foreshadowing? Keep up. We've still got a little bit more exposition to deliver. Okay. Just know that shades of brown blend into the background too much. They're so... normal. Not me, though. I'm not like other girls. I like to wear black and paint my nails black, and I even take my coffee. Black? Yeah, how'd you guess? You must be pretty punk rock. Why don't you come cut class with me and join the dark side? I find your reluctance to fit in pretty metal. Um, no. I think I'm gonna be late for second period. Oh, come on. Why fit in, like, neutral colors when you could be a revolutionary with a hundred percent original ideas like me? Down with the system, Gray! Power to the people! Excuse me, I thought I heard speak of revolution. That would be against school conduct. Plus, it's also un-American. Oh god, not him. Oh, is that a Gray? Odd. Well, we can fix that. Good morning! I'm White, the student body president. Welcome to Prisma Academy. But you really should change. My dad owns all of the North Face and Southern Tide, so I'd be happy to lend you the right wardrobe. Don't let his charming vernacular and friendly visage fool you. Everyone knows white people are pure evil. Come now, Black, those are awfully strong words to describe us. Pure evil? I prefer the term student council. It's much more pleasant. Why is every student at this school an asshole? Yes, Black, that little nobody over there has a point. Why do you choose to be so difficult and rabble-rousing? Gray, why don't I show you the proper moral way things work here? We could discuss it over the next lacrosse practice if you'd wish. Actually, you seem like more of a golf person. Want to take my yacht? My chauffeur parked it next to my limousine and private jet. I, I fly first class, of course. Okay, we get it. You're a douche. Yeah, go back to the fucking country club, you prep. You're just mad because my life matters. And you're just a whiny SJW who won't stop complaining. Check your privilege. Check your choker. I think it's cutting off the air supply to your brain. Enough! First of all, these are the lamest insults I have ever heard in my entire life. And second, all of this hatred is pointless. You two are the same color. All three of us are. <gasps> Treason. Heresy. Slander. How dare you compare me to him? He's so... She's just... We're... The... Same color. You're just different shades, different tints. Now, I would love to stay around for your obvious upcoming musical number about how much you hate each other, but I have to prepare for a party I don't want to go to. I hate this school. So, you want to sing this I hate you song now, or... <sighs> sure. Are you going to start? Why do I have to start? Because I'm not going to start. Start it. Start singing. Now. No, screw you. I'm not your slave. Wow, playing the black card. Typical. Well, I guess we're not singing now. Fine. Fine. We're going to make out later, right? At this rate, probably. Okay, bye. Hate you. <laughs> Hate you, too. Okay, yeah, she's finished fourth block. Her first day of social conditioning, I mean, high school, is over. She should be returning to base soon. Yes, we should conceal our identities. Computer, protocol 404, initiate the disguise-induced camouflaging kinesthetic system. Initiating protocol 404. D-I-C-K-S. Computer, I told you not to call it that. Protocol 404. Dicks erected. <sighs> Alright. Now that we've got our dicks, we're completely disguised. Just in case her memory chip falters, wait. We reset those properly, right? Experiment stupil. Hi, Dad. And Dad? How'd you enjoy your first day of brainwa- high school? How's Prisma? To make any friends? Well, um, no, everyone's super territorial, but I'm going to a party tonight, and maybe I'll meet someone nice there. 
Yes, honey, sleazy high school parties on the first day of school are definitely the best place to make lifelong friends. Well, I just wanted to change clothes and check in on my parental units before leaving. Oh, come now, honey. You're our daughter. You're definitely not a cyborg. But if they have a pool, do not swim in it. And avoid electromagnetic pulse grenades at all costs. Will do. Thanks, dads. Hey, do you... Do you think that someone... Someone like me could maybe... Yes? Change something? I, I just feel like... Like there's so much tension and... Well, I feel like maybe I can make a difference in this school, you know? Make the social system there less rigid and miserable. Thank you. That's, um, encouraging. I know, I know. She's not programmed to feel. She's definitely not programmed to enact change. She's a, she's a sponge, not an enzyme. We'll have to monitor her activities more closely. Or let it play out. Что происходит, когда это идет не так, как? Well, I guess we'll see. So then I said, um, actually, Miss Emerald, the cliche of starting a scene with "so then I said" is quite tacky writing and actually so overdone. Yes, Queen, spill that tea. Pink, are you okay? You're not laughing at Salmon's amazing comedic relief. And that's pretty much his entire character, so... Oh, no, it's not that. I'm just... This is gonna sound literally so stupid. But I'm just kinda worried about that gray girl. Ew, why? I bet she has hemorrhoids. Yeah, well, I know the social atmosphere here can be ruthless. She's gonna be torn apart if she doesn't pick a color and gain some status. And what about it? If that little loser wants to be a loser, let her be a loser. We warned her. Bitch ass girl. The f Ooh, girl, that's my dick appointment. Let's go inside. You coming, Pink? In a minute, Salmon. Wig. Okay, bye. Popularity. way to make a name if you don't have a name why even play the game that's why the order must stay the same who are you without your name who am i without my name Gray? Ashley. Gray, I'm like so glad you made it. But OMG, you're still wearing those clothes. No tea, no shade, but like, what the hell are you doing? What I want to do? I, I think, I think maybe I'm just supposed to stay this way, you know? Neutral, out of the way. Oh, sweetie, I love that mindset for you. Like, love, love that. But for the last time, that's not how it works. But fortunately, a party is a great way to see what clique you want to join. But so, go out there and socialize. You're doing amazing, sweetie. I believe in you. Yo, listen up, Prisma. We're young, we're gnarly, and most of us are graduating at the end of the year, except probably Red. Plus, we're in a musical set in high school, and this is the big party scene, so you know what that means. That's right, it's time for the Big Party Musical number. Let's get hype! Fuck meaning and fuck deep lyrics. Just turn the music up till you can't hear it. Get wasted, don't pussy out though. Don't need consent, just throw it out the window. Party, pa 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 party, party. Someone pass the weed. Party, pa 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 party, party. Party, pa 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 party. Party, pa 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 Shut, 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 shut. Party, pa 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 Oh shit, here come the cops, cops. The rap is vulgar. 
base is wailing. The dance floor filled with all the white kids failing. Extreme choreography. Woohoo! Scream the chorus one more time. Party, pa 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 Who's with all the weed? Party, party, pa pa Yeah, I definitely just got more weed. Party, party, pa 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 Shot, 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 party, party, pa 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 someone say party? No, okay, never mind, goodbye. Oh, s sorry. Yo, it's Gray. What is good, mi amiga? I am, um, breathing. Oof, you don't go to parties very often, do you? Oof. <laughs> I was like you once, so here's some advice. The party is a mindset. Letting go of the millions of things that could worry you, embracing the optimistic fun of the world. That is the party. La fiesta. It's a perfect chance to change things up. Listen to that little voice that says, Fuck it, just do it. Don't let your dreams be dreams. So let go and have some fun, but not too much fun and people will think you're weird. Wow, I oddly needed that. Sorry if we got off on the wrong foot this morning. I didn't mean to come off as intimidating. Sometimes, especially at this school, you've got to put up a front in order to survive. <laughs> Look at pink. Look at green. Big oof. No cap. But why? I don't get why these identities are so important to all of you. Like I said, I don't make the social rules or change them, corrupted as they may be. But hey, even if you are a gray and a pink is trying her best to brainwash you... She's... what? I think you're pretty magnifico. I don't want you to think I'm some insane scary asshole like everyone else. <laughs> orange! Orange! I like totally just saw Pad Parachas trying to sneak into the party. You have to like, do something. Oh hell no! I por que este rechazo no esta muerto! Ugh. <whistles> There's a multicolor outside! Take this nigga's kidneys! Hey, where's the bathroom? Straight down the hall, to the left. You can't miss it. Thank you. Wait, hold on. This is the front door. Pink, you're the best I ever had. Don't know how I got such a beautiful girl like you. So glad you're my one and only. Your one and only? You, like, really mean that? Damn straight. Red's the color of love, baby. I'd never let anyone else in my heart. <laughs> Not even ghosts. Red? Who the fuck is hiding in that closet? Uh, my nigga Casper. He's, he's really friendly. Anyone else? Seriously? Wait, that's not a girl? Shit, that explains a lot. Ugh, I'm like so done trying with you, Red. I thought what we had was special. Pink, baby, no. You still uh, the blood in my veins. Why? Because you're definitely thicker than water. Wait, fuck. What I mean is, forget about my dick for a second. I know it's hard, like really, really hard right now. I am having a very strong erection right now. I get it. But try. You know, you're still the only color in my heart. You know what? You're probably right. But I'm definitely not the only person inside your pants, Red. Ow! Go. I don't need you. Wait, fuck. I really, really need you. I'm sorry, I do love you. I promise I will put nobody else above you. Except for her, or her, or her, or him. Wait, shit, I did it again, why do I do this? I'm so stupid. I gave everyone my love and then I lose it. I thought I needed lots of ladies in my life, but pink you were plenty. Now, without you, this bitch empty. Yay! <sighs> why can't somebody just tell me what I did wrong? Hey, yo, what the fuck, why are you here? It, bro, I'm like half naked. She Get the fuck out. knows that love's just sex to you. You say you love but fail to do the things that prove your love is true. Your lust is your main trait. You feign your love and break her heart, then wonder why no love will start. Constrain your dick and play it smart so you can change your fate. You have got to change if you want her back. 
Stop being an asshole. Follow the right track. The right track. Yeah, yeah. Damn, you might be right. Wait, shit, you're really, really right. I broke us, but I can right wrongs. I promise I will be a loving man from now on. Using my passion and care and strength and abs. Listen up, Pink, I hope you're keeping tabs. I'm gonna do this. I won't be stupid. I'll give her everything I've got and then I'll prove it. I've been too scared to broaden my emotional range. But Gray, thanks to you, I know that I can change. Did you just... Fuck. Sorry, almost forgot about the not being a sexual jerk thing. Thank you, Gray. Yo, Pink, wait up! Wait a minute. I kinda helped him change to hero from a ghoul. If I can help change him, I can change the school. I can do anything. I can do anything. I will do anything. I can change this school. Fuchsia, Magenta, we're leaving. But I was just about we're to- We're leaving. Love is dead and this party is not fetch. Period. You're right, Pink. Let's blow this place. Not so fast, Salmon. I'd say I'm sorry to do this to you, but I'm not. What's this? Your pink slip. You can't sit with us anymore. No, 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 no. Pink, please. With, without this click, I'm just, I'm just. Gay. I mean, I was going to say a loser, but oh God, you're right. That's even worse. You, you can't just do that to Salmon. Salmon? Who's Salmon? All I know is a backstabber who made out with my probably bisexual boyfriend. Salmon doesn't exist anymore. Oh, uh, yeah, actually, never heard that name before. <laughs> Me neither. Bitch. <laughs> Ladies? Whoa, hey, hey, I don't know too much about parties, but I don't think people are supposed to be curled in the ball crying during them. You, like, obviously haven't been to many parties. What's wrong? N nothing There is a new episode of RuPaul's Drag Race and I'm missing it, okay? So just go away! No, no wait! Oh, poor gay. Guy! Poor guy! Wait, is that... Blue? What? No. If you're going by the CMYK model, I'm technically cyan. <laughs> art. Art joke. Blue, what are you doing here? I'm watching the party like a creep instead of actually going in and dancing. It's pretty standard wallflower protocol. But why? All the warm colors out there seem to be having a great time. There's like 20 oranges in there. That's so much vitamin C. Yeah, well, nerds like me have to stick in smaller clumps. We're better this way. I just... I, I can't do that. I can't be that. I'm a blue. I'm a socially awkward, code programming nerd. That's what I am. That's my role. And that's all I'll ever be. That's... not true. Really? I have approximately two friends, turquoise and navy, and, well, maybe my left hand if you count him. Your left? Oh. Yeah, he fills the void of where a girlfriend should be. Not like I'll ever get one of those, because I'm just a loser. I'm a geek. I'm Michael in the bathroom, and I've settled with that. The only thing I've been intimate with is my calculator. I know my place in the social stratification pyramid, and it is not on the dance floor. Everyone told me that. I know that. Things don't change around here. So thanks, Gray, but it's getting late. I'm gonna go home and take some Zoloft or something. I have a robotics meeting in the morning. 
The party is a mindset, and this I guarantee You'll have a lot more fun in life if you just dance with me Dance with me I know you wanna dance with me No, and I'm not gonna sing, cause if I sing I know I'll wanna dance with you I kinda wanna dance with you Lamau, what is that blue doing? No idea, but he's kind of feeling himself. What? This guy sucks at dancing. Yeah, but I dig the confidence. Yo, you want to go dance with him? You don't have to ask me twice. Woo! Oh no, what was I thinking? This is completely against the code. They're gonna, they're gonna think... <laughs> Good moves, bro. I... Oh, wow, thanks. Dance with you. I kind of want to dance with you. Dancing is what people do when they don't have to listen to the rules and play. Rules and play. Oh, dance with me today. And we'll keep on dancing. You wanna come vape with us? I, uh, yeah, well, um, nah, what, you, no, what, well, uh, yeah, d sure, let's vape. I can't believe I just said that. Thank you, Gray. I couldn't have done that without you. Ciao. Wait a minute. The nerd just got a friend His loneliness may end And I started the trend I can do anything I will do anything I can do anything I can change this school Yep, it's a running gag now, fuck you. Это очень против плана. Yeah, I know. But I think we can let her divergence slide just a bit longer. Ты серьёзно? Well, I mean, she is experimental. It's not like she's malfunctioned on any of the other tests. If something unexpected happens, we may as well study the results. Это Америка лень. I'm not doing this because I'm lazy. I'm a proud United States Behavioral Studies Specialist. I'm here to carry out this version of the experiment, since it already failed in your country, remember? I take my work very seriously. However, if we were to take a little break tomorrow and get some beers while Grey does her thing... Мне нужно отдохнуть от этого. Exactly. It'd be like a date. Oh no, not like that. No, no. I want to, uh... Um... Let's... <laughs> let's just let Grey free roam a little bit. What's the worst that could happen? Psychology 101, Unit 1, Adolescence, Identity, Personality. Lesson 2, The Link Between Happiness, Humiliation, and Conformity. Please turn your books to the section referring to blatant foreshadowing of upcoming plot in Act 2. Psst, Blue! When are we gonna learn that unit on subtlety? Don't think we know how to do that quite yet. Psst. Green, did you hear about what happened at the party last night between pink and red? No flex, but I got fiery on jaw. Wait, there was a party last night? What? Why wasn't I invited? Pink and I used to be so close. Oh, I guess it was a 6 over type deal. You know. Uh, what deal? Come on, Green, you know how high school works. Only girls with looks 6 out of 10 or over get to come. Pretty much all of Pink's crew was there. But... I was part of Pink's crew too once. You were there, you remember, right? Uh, no. Can't remember Pink hanging out with any greens. Sorry, I don't make the rules. Psst. Gray. Why is everyone whispering? Mrs. Cobalt got bored and left five minutes ago. Oh, I love that for her. 
Well, anyway, I just wanted to make sure we're, like, on the same page about something. See, just because I'm the perfectly pretty pink popular girl with an iron grip on the school doesn't mean we're, like, in Mean Girls or whatever. I thought this whole thing was like Heather's. Really? I was getting divergent vibes. The grouping of students based on random personality traits seems more proportional to Harry Potter. Nah, the stereotypes are totally Breakfast Club, no cap. Ooh, ooh! Maybe it's like Sky High. Uh, you know, without the superpowers. But actually, you all have superpowers because you're all heroes in my heart. No, you fucking idiots. This is clearly the Godfather. My point is, we don't have to be enemies. Really? Oh, good. You just have to follow everything I say and stop changing people and screwing with the status quo so much. Okay? So, it's High School Musical and you're Sharpay. Pink, I've seen what this school's mindset does to people and it sucks. We don't have to follow this dumb color code. Gray, sweetie. Don't call me sweetie. I love this mindset for you, but like, actually, I don't. It's gonna get you killed. There's a structure here that like, has to be maintained. We all internalize it. And we all adhere to it. Now, I'm warning you, if you don't comply- What? What? What are you possibly going to do? Make the school hate me? Been there, done that. Kick me out of your clique? That's fine. Those girls aren't even your friends. The pinks aren't even nice people. Pink? is the nicest color. The color of femininity and compassion. And superficiality. I am letting you know the rules for your own good. And this is how you're repaying me? I have your best interest at heart. I bet you don't have a heart. You're probably as fake and archetypal as the rest of the school. Admit it. Who do you think that you're fucking with? The order, it must remain the same. Don't go testing me. Don't you try, sweetie. Cause you'll find that you're really out of your league. Because I rule the school. I rule the school. You should back down. Oh, she'll for you like a piranha plant. Oh, you stepped out of line. First time it was fine. But you're gonna have to start to learn your place. Just get out of my face. Why do you enforce the status quo? Because without one, there's no structure, place, or rhyme. It is time for us to let it go. Uh, of course not, people need the system to survive. Why do colors mean Gray, so I'm much? warning you. You guys use them like Gray, I'm crutch. warning you. Time to stop. I've had enough of this bullshit because... Gray, I'm warning you. Please. I'm changing the school, but I rule the school, and bending the rules. I said, but I rule the school, I changing rule the, the school. school, and ending your rule. I warned you. I warned you. I warned you. I rule the school. What's this? It's a flyer, silly willy. My grandma offers wonderful funeral services. Ooh, ooh. And seeing as how you just challenged Regina George, I mean, Pink's authority, you're probably gonna need it. I, uh, thank you, I guess? Friends help friends. Always. Wow, you're like one of the few colors at this school that doesn't suck at all, really. What's your secret? <laughs> my, my, my secret? Yeah, I mean, how do you stay so happy all the time? <laughs> oh, it's nothing, really. I'm just like this. 
I'm like this all the time. I. Oh, hey, my. My candy. Yeah, yeah, my candy. Oh, I love candy and sweets and air and sunshine. And BDSM. <laughs> Ignore that last one, but I just love life. Isn't life fan freaking tastic right now? Let me help you pick those up. No, 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 yeah, yeah, I was holding on to them for for blue, yeah, for blue. And I might have taken one, or two, or three, or maybe the whole bottle, you know, just to try to numb the pain, you know, just out of curiosity. <laughs> help, help me please. <laughs> help. <laughs> Jello, are you okay? What? Me? Sad? <laughs> as if. <laughs> Am I sad? Are you a Russian robot sent here as an experiment to spy on us? Uh, I don't think so. Good. Don't think about it. Actually, never think about it. I never think about things for too long, because that always leads to the sadness. Oh, but not me. I am happy. That's me. That's my whole brand, sis. I'm so happy. Whee! Yellow, are you okay? I am sunshine. I am rainbows. I am the one beacon of light at this dreary, depressing hellhole. I'm happy. I'm happy all the time. Constantly. To make other people happy. Woo! Comedic relief. Yeah. I bury all my negative feelings to be happy. Woo! I'm so happy I take pills to be even more happy. I am the light of everyone's life. The joy of everyone's day. Because... Because I have to be happy. Because if I am not happy, then no one else will be. And it's just so much pressure. It's so fucking much. You know you don't have to be happy all the time, right? <laughs> yeah, that... That seems to be a pretty obvious and heavy-handed lesson now that you said it so blatantly, but I I totally get it. Thank you, Gray. Well, friends help friends. Always. Yeah, but being here for me, I appreciate that. People are so freaking fake here, it just feels like you can't open up to anyone. It's like they're all made in a lab somewhere. Like they're machines. Cyborgs. <laughs> Whoa, what was that? Not sure, but if I don't go now, I'm gonna be late for class. Again. I'll see you, Yellow. See you, Gray. I'm gonna go outside the school and cry and curse and listen to Hamilton for a little bit. Uh, you do that. Hey, watch where you're going, hello? Oh, fuck off. I'm the gay one? You're the one holding a bouquet of pansies, you fucking faggot. Uh, wow. You've never clapped back before. I'm actually kind of touched. Hey, bitch! I, I mean, uh, Pink. I'm here to fucking woo you and shit. And you plan on doing that by calling me a bitch? Probably not the best start, but, um, but I've been changed. I'm a romantic dude again. I'm like an actual full-on lovey-dovey punk pussy ass now. <laughs> okay, wow. Fuck you guys, too. This is like some genuine emotional vulnerability shit going on right now. Ain't exactly my forte, but I wrote a whole ass poem to prove I've changed. Poems are romantic as shit. Oh, dearest Pink. Ho! Yo, whole body and aphrodisiac. That's an awfully fancy word for someone like you to use. Do you even know what it means? Uh, no, I, I stole it from purple. A fucking course. Bitch, can I finish the fucking poem? Damn. That's so fine, it makes me feel hella exuberant and shit. I want to nuzzle my face in your... the be Uh... Hey, Blue, can you, uh... It's pronounced voluptuous. Thanks, bro. I want to nuzzle my ass in your vol velociraptor boobs. And finally, I want to get you in my bed and completely photosynthesize your... Okay, stop. Orange, you got this on your snap, right? Post it. Fuck. No. Pink. 
That was supposed to be an intimate thing between you and me. Because that's what love is, you know? Intimate. I'm romancing you so hard right now, you have no fucking idea. No, you're embarrassing yourself in a public setting. And I'm going to use this as leverage to further plot your downfall as revenge against cheating on me. It's pretty typical teenager stuff, TBH. Oh, so, so you're punking me? Yes. Okay, that's a bit fucked up, not gonna lie, but I still love you. I'm, I'm gonna prove it, and a little bit of humiliation ain't gonna stop that. Oh, really? Oh, dearest Pink. <laughs> oh, <laughs> your whole body and... Oh, what's this? Is he going red in the face? Is he That's actually so feeling <laughs> shame <laughs> for wronging someone? <laughs> I love that for you. How does it feel, Red? How do the eyes of judgment feel, Red? I bet they feel lovely. As lovely as all those girls you slept with under my nose. How does it feel, Red? How does it feel? Love hurts, don't it? Wig was snatched. I warned you. I warned you. I rule the school. Death drop. <laughs> wow, Pink, that was terrifying, but beautiful. You wrecked that jerk. Not that I was like watching or anything, though. Haha, <laughs> uh, yeah. Who are you? I'm Green, your former best friend. I was thinking we could go back to that, you know, now that you're not busy with Red anymore. Uh. Do you. Do you really not remember me? Uh, yikes. Pink and green? Yeah, kind of an ugly color combo if you ask me. Sorry. But hey, at least you got to talk to me. Most people don't get that far, so like, love that for you. Au revoir? Au revoir? <laughs> when I don't know how to say it. Is it in French? Uh, yeah. Au revoir? Au revoir. Where's that Somebody? Like her? No, that's au revoir. Oh, is that that same thing? She says it the way, au revoir. I mean, it doesn't have to be au revoir. I just thought it would be kind of funny. It is, if I knew how to say it. You can also say, like, bye, sweetie, or XMXL later. Okay. Okay. Uh, yikes. Pink and green? Yeah, kind of an ugly color combo, if you ask me. Sorry. But hey, at least you got to talk to me. Most people don't get that far, so like, love that for you. XOXO, bye sweetie. Hey, wait, Green! Shh, it's okay, Gray, it's okay. Oh god, Red was right, this is the Godfather. What? No. We just needed you to get in the shadows without attracting the rest of the school. Especially white. That was... unorthodox? Exactly. That's our whole thing. I was up in the school's ventilation system when I heard you your face off against Pink a few minutes ago. Uh, why were you- And your actions just reaffirmed my conspiracy theory from earlier. You're a total nonconformist. Like us. That's why I planned this impromptu kidnapping. So we could show you the dark side. The dark side? Heh. <laughs> Obsidian. Drums, please. Hey, so you're tired of school, so you're tired of rules, I got a fix to make you feel important. Go follow me through this door, and we'll go rabble some more, just let out all the things you're keeping dormant. If you wanna be an individual, then wear what we wear, say what we say, and you'll learn the ways of nonconformity. In this school, you will be prey till you learn the ways of nonconformity. 
You have to wear black, and you have to talk smack, and you have to be edgy while not being trendy. You listen to Panic and listen to Green Day while cutting your wrists up. Hey, isn't this great, Gray? If you wanna be an individual, then wear what we wear, say what we say, and you'll learn the ways of nonconformity. In this school, you will be prey till you learn the ways of nonconformity. Nonconformity. Yeah. Yo, Black, and City and I are gonna go jewel in my car because we're special and different. Rock on, guys! So, what do you think? We're pretty punk rock, right? Black, this is bad. Like, very, very bad. What? Wow. Typical. You know, I thought you were different. But now I realize no one's different. You're just another conformist. No, Black. You are. The fuck did you just say? You're a conformist. Take it back. No, because you know I'm right. You spend so much time trying to not be normal. Shut up. And waste your time with a group of people that you barely like just to fit in somewhere because- I said shut up! Because you're actually terrified of standing out, aren't you? You pay lip service to this idea of individualism when in reality, you force yourself to conform to nonconformity. And that's- that's sad, Black. And what other options do I have, Gray? What other option is there besides this? It's either sit at the cool kid's table or feel like you're sitting alone. It's either wear what everyone else is wearing or feel like you're wearing no clothes at all. It's, it's either be everyone else or be yourself. Why not be you? I... I don't know who that is. Well, you're not going to find out through labels. Labels aren't very punk rock, are they? No, they're not. Sorry for being a bitch. It's not a big deal, but um, what are you gonna do from here? You know what? Fuck society. And fuck the notion of fuck society. I'm gonna do whatever I want to do. That's the spirit, I think. Oh, and sorry for making you 30 minutes late to class. Wait, what? Ah, uh, not again. I'm here! I'm... here. Ugh. Oh well. Hey, Green, do you know where- We were so young Friends united So excited to be Together We just play out our parts But I still have you at heart Am I still in yours somewhere? Am I masked with your mascara? Am I under your Gray? Holy shit, how long were you there? You weren't supposed to hear that. Excuse me, I need to go to lunch. Green, what's wrong? Just move! God, what the hell? Your body is oddly mechanical. Just tell me what's going on. Is this about pink? Don't you two have history? <sighs> Not anymore. We were so young so Superficial, ingenuous, ostensible, but you stayed. I had to go, couldn't keep up the show. Now I'm someone that you used to know, and I'm sorry that I changed. But it's what I have to do. And I know that you're not happy 
Why? No offense, but Pink is kind of the main antagonist of the play so far. She didn't used to be, though. I knew her before all the pressure to fit in. I knew us before all the pressure to fit in. I know the genuine side of her that is buried under all that makeup. I hate that this is what we've become. But didn't you choose to be green after leaving her? I did, but I never asked for this. I never asked to be this artsy, vegan, eco-friendly caricature. It was forced upon me. Want to know a secret? I love meat. Huh. I said it. The president of the environmentalist club is dying for a quarter pounder. Yeah, want to know another secret? I hate this color. Green is my least favorite color. I did enjoy it once upon a time when it was a naturalistic escape from the plastic world of being pink. But then everyone's expectations and stereotypes just keep pushing me down into this horrible costume. That's all it is. A stoner costume. And yet, no matter how hard I try to rip off these ugly, vomit-colored clothes, I keep waking up in them. Again. And again. And again. That's why I'm jealous of pink. I want to be with her again not be this. There. I said it. You happy now? It's not like any of this matters. Apparently, once you gain a new perspective and leave your old color, you're a traitor and you can never come back. So just leave me alone so I can go eat bacon and cry. Wait! Green, come back! I haven't resolved your character arc! <sighs> Alright, whatever. I guess I'll just have to do that later. Oh, shit. Ugh, I can't be late again. You on the same deal. I know, right? So then, <coughs> so then I said, "That's that's America, motherfucker." <laughs> doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Nothing matters. I don't matter. I don't even have a name assigned to this damn play. Why am I even assigned to this experiment? I'm colorblind. <laughs> drunk! I'm not drunk! Who do you think I am? I wouldn't get drunk on the job. What about my sloppy tone and unstable body language would imply to you that I'm drunk? Unacceptable. You cannot defund the arts program. Prisma is an educational locus of the arts and humanities! You know as well as I do that with my status, any and all funding to clubs and activities must be passed through me. It is not in your jurisdiction to delegate funds. You are a student postulant with none of the authority of an administrator. It is my jurisdiction when my father generously donates thousands of dollars to the school year. What? cosmic twist of fate is this? The hierarchy clearly dictates that purple activities like art and creativity are secondary to the needs of more profitable ones. What is more important and profitable than the arts? <laughs> I'm sorry, Purple, but your funding must be given to Orange and his sports teams. They need more help. But the arts can secure the students! Music and photography are invaluable outlets to assuage those disconcerted, floundering students and allow them to express themselves imaginatively! Troubled, struggling students like... 
Like that. What in the name of Allah is wrong with her? She seems... fine. <laughs> Even though her conduct is completely against the morality of the school rules. Yelling, snooping, causing a whir. Very atypical for a gray, but... Anyway, if I were you, I would leave this lost soul alone and find a new little hobby that actually matters in this world, and continue to follow along the color code that the student council has laid out for you. Or you may end up like Gray here. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> gray! Gray! Return to the Halcyon Times! Realize your serenity! Pass into the iris! What is wrong with you?! Perhaps this quandary may be resolved in prayer? Oh, say shalom bim romav We are say shalom, shalom Wait, come back! I haven't resolved your character arc! Purple? Where is green? Where am I? You are in the presence of the soon-to-be wait room. It was the art studio, but arts don't matter in the hierarchy, apparently. Hierarchy? Have you not read the handbook? Well, I suppose the Earth has only revolved twice since your debut in this educational institute. It is to be encountered within the student conduct faction. I believe a certain student body president had his father generously donate a borderline riotous sum of money to include it. The social stratification pyramid. At the top, whites and pinks, either extravagantly wealthy and beauteous pulchritude and social influence, or extravagantly wealthy and, to be forthright, extravagant wealth. Below are oranges and reds, their fervor and physical or sexual vitality, keeping them from towering atop others on the pyramid. Subordinate to the indecent hues are purples and blues. Though subjectivity is inexorable given my monochromatic adherence, I will undertake a venture in subduing my partisanship. In my cursory evaluation, I must state thus. If it were a meritocracy or geniocracy, our intelligence and creativity would be of some significance, but this is not a mediocracy, hardly is it a geniocracy, no, this is a high school organized anarchy. Which remains yellows, greens, and blacks to occupy the bottom stackings. The rebels, the inebriated, the thespians. Most of us do not like where we are ordinated to be, but assimilating into a color is more ideal than just adorning neutrality. Neutrality is obscurity. Neutrality is isolation. No one aspires to suffer the melancholic misery of solitude, the trepidation of social absence. Are... are you asleep? Huh? No, I... Uh, no, I'm good. Just confused. I don't see gray on the pyramid. Exactly! You defy the system by merely existing. They cannot shove you into a proverbial box, which is why pink and white have presumably concocted a stratagem for your complete obliteration. Akin to how the tyrants have decimated red, and how they plan to enact the aforementioned to me as well, since I now have a conviction of substance. Or at least, I convinced myself I did. Goliath, we are facing Goliath. But he stole and Joseph's coat of many colors. And no to face the giant So we're slaves to him We pray to him, to him. But I pray I pray to Allah To give us the strength And I pray for a savior to come and save the day I pray to Yahweh I pray and pray and pray 
but no one comes. Whoa! That's it! Pardon? We can topple Goliath. We can be the changers. If I can get white and pinks to realize how miserable this system is making everyone, I can get them to help me change it. But I'll have to do something bold. Bolder than you achieved before? Is that even feasible? Anything is possible with faith, Purple. You believe in that, right? Yes, but at this exponential gradation of dauntlessness, you are bordering on martyrdom. It does not sit well in my spirit. You crave change, but are you scared to stand with me in enacting it? You want to make a difference without making any effort? That is a bold accusation for someone of your status. Who are you to tell me about faith? Purple, if you want to change things with me, you can't hold on to the same reductionist mindset that White does. Having a savior is nice, but I think now we need to save ourselves from this. So are you with me? I suppose all things are possible with the strength of Allah. I'm in. What do I need to do? Alack! Does your body usually vibrate mechanically, or...? I'm in the process of forming a plan to show how these colored boundaries are stupid, but I'm going to need your artistic touch to make it convincing. Can you help? Indubitably. Great! I'll see you tomorrow! Uh, okay. Godspeed, Gray! I can do anything. I will do anything. I can do anything. Here we go. Yo, Gray, I didn't know you had PE with me. Oh my Tims, bro, it's the best class. We finna get lit, pumped. It's grind time, bro. Let's get this bread. Woo! Oh, oh, adios mio, what is that on your head? It's a beanie, Orange. Ahora no es el tiempo para esos jueguitos. You can't wear tie-dye. Gray, what the fuck are you doing? I'm gonna go out there and show them that we're more complex than one color. I'll defy the system by showing them that being a multicolor is fine. It'll be great. No, great, tonta, you're just gonna- Yo, orange! Oh, hey guys. Me, Sandstone, and Amber, and we're gonna go shoot some hoops, you up? Yeah, yeah, d definitely, broskies. You good, bro? You're over here talking to a great and you're sweating? Dude, bro, bro, dude, bro! I haven't seen you sweating, like, ever. I'm getting tired, dude. Bro. Bro! Dude! Totally radical 360 flip, dude, bro! Are you okay? Nah, dude, I'm lit. I just gotta, uh, I gotta go to the bathroom. Bad. Yeah? Uh, you're doing great, sweetie, but I think you're in the wrong bathroom. Oh. Oh god, lo siento. It's okay. I love you, but I can't keep your secret safe. I if know, you... I know. I'm sorry. I was just... I'm finna head out. I'm sorry, Gray. Necesitas hacer lo que necesitas hacer. What did you do to him? Nothing, I swear! Orange hasn't come this close to crying in a long time, Gray. I was there last time he did, because sisters support each other, Gray. What did you do? I was just trying to express myself. Orange stopped me. Let me spill the tea. You have a problem. You keep wanting to shove people out of their comfort zones. You keep trying to change everything just for the sake of changing things. Well, some of us are happy where we are. Happy with who we are. Ever thought of that? Not all of us hide who we are like Orange has to, okay? What's wrong? Is he okay? Just drop this little rebellion before I make you, Gray. Please, I'm warning you. No! Something is clearly wrong with you people. If you don't have to hide who you are, Pink, then why do you wear all that concealer? Excuse me? The lipstick, the eyeshadow, the mascara, the hair extensions. I, I need all this stuff. It's my status. 
Don't come for my brand like that, sis. Isn't it tiring being this perfect feminist icon all the time? Wouldn't it be easier to let all the surface level stuff go and just be you? What do you know about being me, huh? You think you're tough shit because your boobs are flat, your hair is shaved off, and you don't wear any makeup? We all wear makeup gray. We all apply a face mask whether we want to or not. I can't just give up the fact that I'm... Pink, you can stop the facade. It's okay. I tried hard to keep things cute and nice. But you won't take my fuck. King advice. Girls should stick together. A sisterhood forever. But I think you just fucked with the wrong bitch because I rule the school. I rule the school. I warn you. Oh, shit. Ooh. I'm telling you, man. You want to be less of a stressed out spaz? Try this. Ooh, a brownie. Yum. What flavor is it? Edible. Okay. Uh. How is this going to help me? Uh, usually takes a bit for oh, it to- fuck, man! What's going on? <laughs> There's messages in every game. Like Pac-Man. Do you know what Pac stands for? P-A-C. Program and Control. He's Program and Control Man. The whole thing is just a metaphor. He thinks he's got free will, but really he's just trapped in a maze. In a system! I think I like you better like this. I fucking heard her talking about it, bro. You have to tell me. I'm afraid that is classified information, Red. Whoa, 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 calm the fuck down. Don't fucking attack me with big ass words just because I'm gonna kick your ass if you don't tell me. You think classified is a big word? Ah, fuck, stop it. That shit hurts. What are you guys talking about? I, uh, nothing. I was stalking Pink. Michael Myers style to get back with her because, you know, that's what chicks digging a guy. I don't think... And I overheard her talking with this nerd about something dealing with files and shit. It has to be about me. It has nothing to do with you, Red. If anything, it has more to do with Grey. What? Oh, I've said too much. But I suppose if you helped me once, I can help you now. It would be the right thing to do. Oh, but you won't help me. Come on, dude, you're breaking the fucking bro code. You provide no value in this friendship other than being sufficiently attractive. Thank you. No homo, though, right? Down the hall, in a specific room, some very important people are meeting. They're... they're meeting about you. I would help you more, but at this point it may be out of my hands. But I can't help but feel responsible for what may happen to you, so... I'm so sorry. Whatever you did, it's okay. I forgive you. But how will I know which room it is? It'll be the one with music playing. I think they're about to start the next musical number. Yep, there it is. Good luck in your investigation, but you two did not hear this from me, understood? I've called you all here today to... I have called Orange! Can you please turn that down? I'm trying to monologue. Thank you. I've called you all here today to discuss the gray problem. I have kept up with her antics and watched her closely on the security cameras. She's stirring up too many changes at Prisma. She made red emotionally vulnerable. She made blue dance. She made yellow cry. Gray seems to have an insatiable need to change things and wreak havoc on the order. Thank you for the exposition, White. I already knew this, but completely agree. Which is why I have a plan to remove this desaturated little tumor from the student body. 
Come on, dudes. Gray isn't that bad. I mean, sure, she doesn't fit in, but like, is that really that bad? Not only does she not fit in, she's actively disrupting the social order. But the order is whack, though. I mean, don't get me wrong. I like my spot at the top. I do, but it, it's just getting tiring pulling all these multicolors, you know? This is the danger of her mindset. But even though you're corrupted, you did your job. And I love you for that. You have the pen drive, right, Orange? <sighs> yeah. Blue gave it to me this morning. Lovely. <clears throat> okay, now you can turn up the music. Gray thinks she's got it. Oh, Gray thinks she's won. Thought I was checkmates, but we've just begun. She wants to change things. Well, go right ahead. Cause thoughts like that will leave her dead. I mean, like socially. I wouldn't literally kill her. But you know, actually, my awesome plan might literally kill her. It's time to discharge the weapons I've held. It's time to get this bitch expelled. Cause this is my evil plan to restore the school again. My sacred and evil plan that I'll shout throughout the land. I rule the school. White, you're the student body president. What are the grounds for expulsion in Prisma Academy? Student is disorderly. She is that. Disruptive? She's done that. Threat. You know she really called me out, I felt attacked. Harassed. You know she bothers everyone by just existing. Repeatedly late to or skipping class. Constantly. I bet she's skipping classes to deal with someone's issues at this very moment. Damn, Grace, she's kinda got you there. But the final nail in her silver coffin, the final thing that seals the deal, the thing that makes her oh so guilty is this fact. Gray's not real. Gray's not real. She's not real? Nani! She doesn't even go here. Literally. I pressured one of the blues to hack into the school's student database to find out any dirt on her. Yup. There's no records of her in the system. At all. For all we know, she's just a random delinquent roaming the halls, possibly being a threat to the student body. She could have weapons of mass destruction. And we can't have that, can we? I guess we can. And on this small pen drive is all the information To make sure this thotty gets kicked from the school Believe me, I warned her that bad things would happen When trying to challenge my rule Now come and stand hand in hand My scheme is awesome, my scheme is grand I'll have her cancelled from this land because this is my evil plan. This is her evil plan. This is my evil plan. This is her evil plan. This is my evil. This you is know I love that for you, plan. but you can't go messing with my evil plan. Now, White, I trust you can go to the administrator sometime and tell them of all Gray's atrocities. Most definitely, Pink. And Orange, I trust you can upload this info and make it known to the general public to ruin her already horrible reputation? Or at least bully someone else into doing it. <sighs> yeah, I. Excellent. Now, if you'll excuse me, there's a 50% off sale at Sephora, and if I don't get the newest Michael Kors Gucci Vuitton purse, I might literally have my period. It's just girly things, White. You wouldn't understand. Shit! Great! Hide. I'll buy you time. Pink's gonna leave and find out we've been spying on her and eavesdropping and shit. Eavesdropping on who? Uh... Nobody. Hey, uh, wait though. Ugh, like, we already went over this. I don't love you anymore. Period. But you didn't get to hear the song I wrote for you. You wrote me a song? In a musical? Aw, oh, I love that for me. Uh, yeah, yeah. It goes like, I love you, bitch. I ain't never gonna stop loving you, bitch. Never mind, that's it, I'm done. Wait! No, Red, I will not. 
Okay, keep singing just a little. In this school split into factions, we could have all the traction. This love is a distraction to stop your plan of action. A distraction? Uh, la, 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 la. Don't look behind me. La 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 la. There's nothing to see. La 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 la. la. Definitely not your enemy. La 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 la. Let's go to the next scene, please. While you put up a convincing argument. And by argument, I mean abs. But, oh, what the hell, we're back together. <sighs> now let's go to the mall so you can buy me a bunch of expensive clothes. Fuck yeah. Wait, shit, hold on. Wait, are you sure this is the right thing to do? We're going to expel a girl just because we don't like her? That's a big oof, no cap, bro. I algo muy malo en esto. Um, sorry, I don't speak Mexican. I just don't have a good feeling about this, you know? And you're the color of purity and morality and stuff. Is what we're doing wrong? Orange, lots of people say that there is no black and white, and that there's a gray area in every situation. Yeah? Well, those people are wrong. We are clearly doing the appropriate thing. No objections, 1000%. This is the white way. Right way, right way, my bad. But still, just don't question it. Bury whatever feeling of doubt you have in your beliefs deep down and never let it out. That's how I deal with all my conflicting moral beliefs anyway. I don't think- Exactly. Don't think too hard about it. Adios. Hey, Gray, what are you- <laughs> You you really startled me. What do you have behind your back? Oh, on this pen drive, it's a journalism project. Pink White and I just uncovered some, uh, loca Russian government conspiracy theory. Puedes creerlo? <laughs> what kind of theory? Color theory? Wow, really? That's- Awesome! I can totally help you with that project! Really? Yeah. I I've learned a lot about colors in their short time I've been at this school. Their behaviors, their motivations, their secrets. It's pretty fascinating. So what do you say? Can I help you out? I don't want to do this anymore. Wh what? I use meal. I don't want to hurt you. I never wanted to hurt anyone. All of these weirdos and multicolors are such good people. I don't deserve this. I don't deserve this. I shouldn't have to keep this part of me hidden. Orange, what are you- I'm so tired of hiding who I am. I just want to fit in. It's easier now that I'm on testosterone, but I, I just want to be comfortable being me. Me in this body. It it shouldn't matter so much, but I, but it does. And I hate it. You know, it's 2019. You don't have to hide that you're trans anymore. You'd think so, right? But here we are, plotting out evil plans to destroy you just because you're different, like me. But unlike me, you actually have the cojones to be you. Authentically. You know what? White is wrong. Pink is wrong, too. The whole school is wrong. Great. Pink has an evil plan to destroy you. Trust me, I'm aware- But I know how to stop it. Quiero ayudarlo. So first. Thank you. But doesn't White still hold a lot of the cards? Yeah, but- I think you can talk him out of it. I mean, look at how many people you've changed over the past three days. You may not have a defined personality, but you do have that. Thank you. And if talking doesn't work, I have a little secret from journalism class that might aid the convincing. All you need to do is... That's genius! I just hope I can pull it off low-key. Buena suerte, Gray. Oh, and one more thing. What? Oh, for the love of- <laughs> Psychology 101, Unit 1, Adolescence, Identity, Personality, Lesson 3, The Climax. In this lecture, we will be discussing how the protagonist conquers the last few obstacles in the story, resolves everyone's issues, and then gets to the big plot twist ending. You will have homework tonight, an essay on how to break the fourth wall without being over the top about it. <sighs> Am I... late? Not yet. <sighs> now you are. 
Oh, come on! <laughs> According to the attendance record, this is your 4,376th tardy in the past three days alone, Miss Gray. You'll need to go to in-school suspension. Mrs. Cobalt, come on! 4,376 tardies? There must be a mistake! Those records are clearly hacked by someone out to get me. I haven't even been here for three days. Talking back to the only teacher in this play, you'll have to stay two hours longer. Look, I'm sure if we just talked things out and sang a musical number, you would change and realize how cruel and unreasonable you're being. You want a musical number? Fine. <clears throat> no. Okay, I get it! But I don't know where the ISS room is. Uh, I can take her there, Mrs. Cobalt. Two birds with one stone. Works for me. Leave. Thanks, Green. No, thank you. <laughs> I've been thinking a lot about what you said about Pink. Wasn't that yesterday? We were so young back then. Anyway, yeah, I've been giving it a lot of thought, but I just... I still don't know what to do. I can't go back to being pink, but I don't want to be green. I really just want my friend back, but she'll never accept me as I am now. It's against the code. Green, if she wouldn't accept you as you are, then she's not your friend, and she never really was. Damn, that's deep. It's really not. <laughs> yeah, you're right. <laughs> I'm a little high right now. <laughs> a little, uh, very high right now, but... Uh, but good advice is still good advice. Well, uh, here we are. This is the ISS room? What? No, this is White's office. White has an office at this school? You really should have joined the Earth Club. We talk about greedy capitalist shit like this all the fucking time. The bourgeoisie have too much power. Green. And the fact of the matter is... True communism has never been implemented. Karl Marx had some good-ass ideas. Green. Plus, he was kind of hot. I mean, have you seen his- Green! Why did you bring me to White's office? I'm already in enough trouble. I can't miss more school. Orange told me about his plan to destroy you. Now's your chance to change his mind. He won't listen to you any other way. Trust me, I know the stubbornness of the 1%. <sighs> well, wish me luck. Oh, you don't need luck. You just need something to blackmail him with. Speak of the devil. Yeah, well, screw you too. The dress code of the school is slavery. If I want to show a nipple while wearing my hashtag no lives matter shirt, I should be able to, you asshole. The code must be followed. It's a reoccurring theme in the play. Black, you should know this by now. Good luck in detention. Though it should feel like home to you at this point. You- I- ah! Terribly sorry about that little... disturbance. Can I help you with anything? Oh, well, Green and I were just... <sighs> Can I come in? I just wanted to talk to you about something. Oh, absolutely. So nice to see you. Just close the door when you come in. Sure, thank you. Okay. Well, I was just hoping we could have a nice, civil discussion Listen about- Listen here, you little cunt. I've worked too hard at this school socially to move up in the ranks just to have some nobody fucking gray come in and tell me how to ruin everything by shaking things up. You hear me, shithead? White is the color of perfection. The other colors, the impulsive reds, the overly curious purples, the superficial pinks, the jaded greens, I am better than all of them. It is that way now, and it has always been that way. It is my job to keep things that way, and you are not going to come in and stop me. Understood? Well, that was easier than I thought. What? Listen here, you little cunt. I've worked too hard at this school socially to move up in the ranks just to have some nobody fucking gray come in and tell me how to ruin everything by shaking things up. You hear me, shithead? You... White is the color of perfection. You can the other turn that off now. The... Jesus, is that really how I sound? Yes. <sighs> well, the cards are clearly in your hand now. What do you want? Sorry? Oh, don't play dumb. What do you want? 
Do you want me to get a blue to unhack your attendance record? Do you want all A's for the semester? Access to any room in the building? A seat at the cool kid's table? What is it? We both know I can't have this information exposed. Well, originally, when I came in here, I wanted you not to expel me, but that won't help you, will it? Help me? Why would you ever want to help me? I've done nothing but plot your downfall. Which is exactly why I want to help you. You're just like every other color at the school. I am not. You really are, though. Maybe your closed-mindedness is the biggest problem here. I mean, have you ever even talked to the other colors in the hierarchy you made? I just choose not to associate with them. That would be out of character. I mean, I, I can't talk to a red. Why? Even being near one will make me a delinquent. What about yellow? I mean, I don't mind if you're yellow. You just shouldn't do it around me. That doesn't even... <sighs> okay, what about orange? His Spanglish is kind of annoying, to be honest. That's... Wow, okay, I guess we're really gonna have to build up to talking to Black. Absolutely, under no circumstances will I even attempt to understand... her. Look, I've always learned that a hierarchy must be followed. It's nature. Those at the top make better choices with better people, and that's why they are there. I am entitled to be where I am, and you're not going to waltz up in here and make me feel guilty about it. It sounds like someone's scared to branch out of their clique. Scared? Why would I be scared? I am not a chromophobe. Ignorance and fear go hand in hand. Oh, so now the new girl is going to lecture the student body president on what he doesn't understand about the school. That's ripe. White, I've spent enough time here to show you how everyone actually is. But you have to keep an open mind, okay? I am not talking to those inferiors. White is the culmination of all colors. I think I know a thing or two about them. White is the color of perfection. The other colors, the impulsive reds, the overly curious purples, the superficial pinks, the jaded greens, I am better than all of them. You really are a good journalist. Fine. I'll try to understand the rest of the school. Great. Oh, also, we're going to do it in song, though, since we haven't had a number in a while, and this is a musical. <sighs> Fine, whatever. Look around at the colors here. Aren't they so endearing to you? Look around at the lives I've met. Don't you want to get to know them? You're gonna get to know them You're gonna get to see That all these different colors Aren't so different from you and me Look around Look around Montage, montage, montage. I was sad because I would try to be something I just wasn't. Never knew what I could become till I had the guts to try it. I just want to. I don't know who to be Look around at what I've shut off And the awesome cost I've suffered Look around at these awesome guys And the messed up lies I believe I'm gonna get to know them I'm gonna get to see Ah, never mind, never mind, never mind. Abort, 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 abort. Don't abort your kids, that's a sin, but abort, abort! I, uh, never mind, Gray, this was a bad idea. What? Why? You were making such progress. We haven't even gotten to the bridge of the song, what's wrong? You want to know why Brown hasn't been in the play yet? Well, it's because of this dramatic reveal. Dramatic gasp! I wasn't always this epic and wealthy. And awesome, and sexy, and spectacular, and amazing, and astonishing, and cool, and humble. 
Once upon a time I had no fame, no name, no status. I was a no one at this school. Can you believe it? To be honest, yeah. And when I got to the top, through working and climbing, I left my old friends in the dirt behind me when I was brown. I once was brown. I, uh, I don't like the racist undertones of this song. And now I... I don't know what to do. How... How can I face my old friends again? My old life again? I've... changed. If I had a friend who abandoned me, I would be willing. So willing to have them back. As long as I knew they'd changed their ways. If I had a friend... I'd go to them again and look around. Tani, eres tú? Sí, eres yo. Whoa, why can't speak Spanish? Honestly, that's way more of a plot test than anything else. ¿Qué pasó? Me abandonaste. ¿Por qué no? I, I was scared, man. It was a dumb and narrow-minded thing to do, leaving you like that. I just really thought that I couldn't be seen with you, that people would view me differently for talking to you, that you weren't worthy to talk to. I was so afraid of being a nobody, and that was fucked up. I'm sorry. I don't know if you'll ever... Tú sepas que no puedo entender mucho inglés, pero puedo entender cuando alguien cambia. Missed you too. Amigos? Amigos. Bet you didn't see this one coming, bitches! Reprise time! I can do anything! Ooh, ooh, great, can I sing with you? I haven't had a song yet, great, I want a song, can I sing with you, great? I can do anything! Well, fuck you too, damn bitch! I can do anything! I can change this! Well, that was emotional. I would cry, but my depression has me scheduled to do that later. Oh, that's so great! He got over his prejudices, and now they're friends again. They're like pink and green, but with an actually resolved character arc. Oh, great. Speaking of pink, you should probably stop her before she... Like... Expels you? Uh, Pink, we were just- Oh, save it. Your little red knight spilled all the tea, sis. I'm real sorry, Gray. But you know when you're making out with a hot girl and you start saying wild shit to turn her on, like, get that ass over here, or come to daddy, or that great chick you hate is trying to stop your evil plan. What? I was really getting into it. Look at the mess you've caused. I see you've already converted orange and made white talk to a literal nobody. Well, to be fair, Brown's not a literal nobody. We still haven't met Clear. Clear? Oh, come on, Clear cannot seriously be a color at this school. Um, okay, rude? Uh, the, uh, what the hell? Yeah, I've been here the whole time, but no one seemed to care. But I think it's time I show myself and sing my own song. <clears throat> Invisible. No! Stop! I love that for you, but I am so freaking tired of these tangents in the script! Ray, you're gonna go to ISS, you're gonna get expelled, and you're gonna stop wreaking havoc on the social sphere of this school! Unfortunately for you, Pink, I've already almost won. You can't stop me! Who gonna check me, boo? Miss Cobalt can. What? Tardies, absences, skimming ISS. Y'all are going to jail! Period! And by that I mean ISS, but I had to make the joke there to sound relevant. It's it's a teenager thing, I think. I think the teens do it nowadays. Something about going to jail. Stay on Twitter. It's all over the damn script if you look hard enough. But... Wait, but... No! No arguing or fighting with me this time. You're coming with me, and there is no sleight of hand trick you can pull to get out of this. Um... Um... Computer, initiate protocol 518! Uh, initiating protocol 518. Hand ex machina.
Are you freaking kidding me? Of all my years of teaching, I'm honestly surprised this has only happened twice now. I don't know how I know how to do that, but maybe it'll get explained later in the plot? Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna roll with that. Just stick with us, audience. The show is almost over. Um, bye, Pink. Someone get her! Do something! I don't get paid enough for this shit. I'm out. I'll catch you in the sequel. Guys, I just gave an order. Why is no one listening to me? Blue? Orange? Red, go after her or I'll break up with you again. Damn it, never mind. Hey, green girl, help me with this. I'm sorry. Are you... Finally acknowledging my existence? Yeah, sure, whatever. Happy freaking birthday. Now help me find Grey. No. Excuse me? Your status isn't high enough to say no to me. Well, I fucking said it. No, I'm not going to help you expose Grey because that girl has been more of a real friend to me than you have been recently. What happened to you, Pink? Do you know who I am? Do you know who I am? No! I bet you don't, do you? Well, does this ring any bells, asshole? That's... That's my old scrunchie. Where did you... Rose? Is that really you? What happened to you? Rose... Rose, this isn't fair. None of this is. You left us, and now you're just green. With envy? Yes, we got that yellow. Look, I... I literally cannot even deal with this right now, okay? Too much is on the line for me at the moment. I need to stop Grey. I can't lose my image? My status? But you've already lost your best fucking friend. Do I mean nothing to you? Popularity and fame Only way to make a name If I don't have my name Am I really the same? If you wanna be the best Your friends get left I warned you We were so young That I'd do We're still so young What I must do Can't we be young? Because I ruled the school Greetings! What events have occurred in the periphery of my cognizance? There's about to be a big showdown between Grey and Pink, probably leading to the dramatic climax we've all been waiting for. I'll upload it to Red, too. Oh, I hope they don't hurt each other. But if they do, I hope it's a bloodbath! <laughs> Wait, but my plea for the art story arc remains unresolved. Oh. Yo, White, can you let Purple have her funding? The sports department doesn't really need the money. TBH, no cap, on jaw. We were just gonna buy more mango pods. Oh, that? Yeah, sure, I don't care. I was just being petty. The hierarchy is relevant. Yay! Y tu verte? Do you not still desire to rekindle your platonic relationship with Pink so your story may reach completion as well? You know what? She's fucking crazy. Damn straight. De verdad? Si. Sí. Amen, sis. She's clearly got extreme image issues. I mean, most of our character arcs here do, but at least we're not fucking crazy. There's no need to be envious of her. Why have friends like her when I can have friends like you guys? I agree. On jaw, my bro! Dude, bro! Oh, fuck yeah. Go green! Yo! Yellow said the F word. Little guy's grown up so fast. I can also say the N word. N- Gah! Oh crap, what am I gonna do? Pink's gonna murder me. Murder? Sounds fun. You've got to stop popping out out of nowhere. My bad. But really, though, what's wrong? I think Pink is about to- A 
Attention students of Prisma Academy, this is your beautiful resident popular girl Pink. I have come to deliver some not lovely news. How is she allowed to broadcast this message? She probably just asked nicely. That's really all it takes when you're hot. Oh, come on, that is such a plot hole. There's a rogue gray on the loose who is like totally gone crazy. We do not stand her. Sis snapped, but like not in the good way. If spotted, please return her to the principal's office so that she can be canceled by our administrators. Any student who snatches the wig of this menace will be rewarded with all A's for the semester. This threat to the school environment must be dealt with, dead or alive. Oh yeah, also make sure you come to the student body assembly this afternoon. We've been building up to this assembly all play, and it would be great if you guys could show up for the penultimate scene. I'm sorry, what? What do you mean there's no mention of this assembly in the script at all? Well, wouldn't it be a good thing to hint at it since it has so much relevance to the plot? Hey, hey, I didn't make the script, okay? Ugh, this is such lazy writing. <clears throat> okay, well, come to the assembly! XOXO, love you guys, have a great day! As if it weren't bad enough. Now I'm somehow more of a target. I know how you feel. Pink and White tried to pull the same shit with me junior year when I wouldn't comply with their standards. But I know a solution that'll fix your problem. Really? What do you do? I made a grand demonstration of rebellion in front of the whole school. Now this next step might get you arrested, but- Wait, no! Black, that's it. I know how to beat Pink now, and also save the school in one step. It'll take some cooperation with the rest of the colors, but I think it'll work. Wait, so we're not getting arrested? <laughs> Lame. Do you think you can keep me hidden from the student body until the assembly today so they don't tear me apart? Staying obscure in the sight of the masses is kinda my whole brand. Excellent. Wait a minute. One more time! Though things seem pretty shit. And Pink still has her rule. If I helped all of them, I'll save this fucking school. We can do anything. We can do anything. We can do anything. We can save this school. Or die trying. Never mind, love that. Anyway, welcome to the annual third day of school assembly. Normally, the student body president would give everyone a motivational speech, but he has resigned. So, as the head cheerleader of this school, I think I'm next on the totem pole. Everyone give it up for me! I said clap, goddammit, or I'll rip your fucking eyes out! shouldn't have. You guys are lovely. Take off your top! Ow! What? Anyway, the real tea is that the reason this assembly is happening is that people don't seem to be excited for the new year ahead of them. That's problematic. So I've decided to graciously prepare a lovely little motivational speech to make everyone feel great about themselves. And to make this even more fun, I made it a song! Yay! You're not special. You don't matter. And that's okay. No, really. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> Fill your role in this system. And stay on script. It's like you're in 
a play. <laughs> We've lived this way for so long, convinced ourselves it's true. And no one's gonna drop down from the sky and rescue you, ha ha ha. When you said we were gonna hide out in the assembly, I didn't think you meant in the ventilation system! Hey, it's not my fault your body is oddly magnetic and heavy and you broke it. No! No, 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 no! No! I will not let you ruin this assembly like you ruined this school for the past three days! Y'all are going to jail! Period! Listen up, Prisma! You... you... You're not special! You don't matter! And that's okay! No, it's really not okay. No! Man. Just fill your role! This great system, it's like you're in a play! I've had enough fourth wall breaks. Look, you've lived this way for so long. Convince yourselves it's true, but it's not. Be yourself, it might be hard, but I believe in you. Come on, Prisma! You're better than this! You are so much more than these arbitrary colors. You've shown me that! If you're with me, stand! Stand. Please? You really don't get it, do you? Why we're all afraid to change. Cause what if nobody likes you? And what if nothing's the same? That's why I must keep my reign. To save them from all that pain You either protect your fame Or it burns out like a flame The status you must attain Just so you can have a name The feelings I have to feign To save me from all that pain The choices that I have made To save me from all that pain this horrid game I have played To save me from all that pain So no, I won't let you change them I won't let you change me Cause I'm so, so scared Of what I might turn out to be Oh, we're not special We don't matter You're not special You don't matter I'm not special I don't matter. I'm not special. I'm not special. You're not special. We're not special. And nothing matters. I'm just. I'm just. I'm just. Pink. Is that really all you think you are? Your identity? What would you know about identity? You? DON'T HAVE ONE! YOU DON'T EVEN KNOW WHO YOU ARE, ASHLEY! What? Come on, you don't really think you're special, do you? <laughs> yes, I do! Wait, no, I mean, uh, uh, well, holy fuck, wait, I, I, I don't, I don't have an identity, do I? Who the hell am I? I forgot my own name. I literally have no idea who I am or what I'm supposed to be, except for what everyone keeps telling me that I should be, or or what I shouldn't be, or that this is that that and uh, oop. Uh, Gray, you okay, sis? N no, I don't think so. I have zero personality besides the fact that I'm kind of quirky and late to class a lot. I I've helped all you feel special and change and find yourselves a ship. But what about me? Who the fuck is Gray? Who am I? Oh my god, wait! It's all coming together! I figured it out! Wait, are we not going to deal with my internal conflicts right now because I'm high-key having an existential crisis and that is not fun? Gray, I love that for you, but I'm like having a super deep epiphany right now. This system, this school, this identity I have to bury the real me under? It's stupid. I should just love myself. We all should. Everyone should love themselves, change for the better, not care what people will think of you, and be yourself! I have been saying this for the entire play! Pray, will you pl 
please let me have my moment. It's just kind of rude that you're like cutting me off here. Like I was about to sing the last song of the musical and everything and now I just, I just need a minute. I am so glad this show is almost over. Maybe I'm special, I am more than this color I adorn Special, I am more than this color I deplore Special, I am more than this color I adorn Special, I am more than the rules that we follow I can do anything can do any I can do anything we can do anything I can do anything I can change this Well, like, Beyonce could literally never. Attention, Prisma! The color code can't come to the phone right now. Why? Oh, because she's dead. We don't stand her anymore. Now go love yourselves, respect yourselves, be free! Finally, we can wear whatever color we want. Well, the fashion statement thing is not what I expected, but Multicolors of Prisma Academy, I am now stepping down from my luxurious reign of 11 minutes as a student body president. And instead, I bestow the honor of making this motivational speech to someone truly motivational. Please welcome Gray. <laughs> Wow, my first speech as president. What could possibly go wrong? What could possibly go wrong? Это все. Yeah, that's all the gradients. Should be everyone who needed to be reset. Oh wait. Looks like we forgot about Ashley. Welp. This version of the experiment went horribly wrong. We've got some reprogramming to do. My best guess is the whole musical thing just threw everything off. Don't know why we gave everyone singing chips this time around, but eh, orders are orders. Oh, the pure hues. Thank you for your monochromacy again. You'll receive your stipend within three to four business days. Oh, right, the tape. I almost forgot about the tape every time. Gosh, O2, what would I do without you? У тебя не будет никого. Кто будет твоим лидером, это точно. Whoa, there are kids here. Save that kind of talk for later. Computer. End project monochrome. Thank you for completing project monochrome. You're probably wondering what just happened. Let us explain. Project Monochrome is a secure experiment designed to observe the effects of teenage social groups using the basics of color theory. If you're listening to this message, you are a pure hue. Congratulations! 
You're not like other colors. You are the purest, most monochromatic individual with your color. You exemplify the behavioral traits most associated with your typical archetype. You are a unique group of adolescents, roughly 17 years of age, that showed an incredible aptitude for understanding psychology and psychological functioning. Most of you volunteered for this position. A few were mandated by your respective asylums, and one of you, in particular, was specifically modified through advanced technology to be an observant in this process. A neutral input. This role is usually delegated to 001. You will know them as Grey. Unfortunately, if you're listening to this message, something must have deeply malfunctioned this time. Perhaps the order was obstructed beyond the perimeters of the experiment. Perhaps one or more of you failed to comply with the agreements you made in your waiver. Perhaps the situation has been irreparably compromised by variables beyond anyone's control. Nevertheless, the experiment is rendered incomplete. The show is over. Your families will receive the compensation for your work in playing your role. Your false memory chips will be removed shortly, and you will receive new ones shortly after all the less important gradients have been reset as well. The experiment will be reset with new variables soon, and you will return to the system. It has been a pleasure working with you, but Project Monochrome is over until further notice. Goodbye! What the fuck? All the plot twists. I mean, I knew from the start that Grey was a cyborg. Of course you did. But I didn't expect this. No. No. Like, this can't be real. None of this is real. I... What is your name? What? Not Pink. What is your actual legal name? I... I don't... No. Does anyone here know their name? I don't either. Well, Ashley had a name. A name we just stripped away from her. As if it didn't matter who she was outside of the color. Do you do you guys think she's okay? I mean they they can they can rebuild her, right? Like in those movies where She's gone, yell I think she's gone. We did this to her, didn't we? We're the reason she's- No, we, we we couldn't have known. But we were jerks to her, and we stopped her from being herself, and now- She wasn't even real anyway. She was just as programmed as the rest of us were, right? Except she malfunctioned or something, and started acting- Like a decent human being. It's more than most of us can say. Wait, wait, wait. Hold the fuck up. We were all in asylums before this? Like, strapped up in a straitjacket somewhere? Apparently so. Well, then they're never gonna let us out, are they? They can't have some deranged teenagers just roaming the streets talking about a crazy government conspiracy. So, if we go for revolution right now, it would make sense for them to off us like they offed gr Ashley, right? This is so not lit. Dab. So we're gonna die? Sweet. No, because if we talk about any of this, they'll just put us back into our institutes. Pretty logical hostage plan, if you ask me. So then, what was the point? Can we ever really escape this indoctrinative system? How many times has this happened? And what happens next? Alright, alright. We removed the singing chips from your necks. God, <laughs> some of you guys really can't sing. What? It's a joke! Jeez, your generation is so sensitive. Ah, speaking of which, Green, you're going to get a kick out of this. We your memory chips malfunctioned. A lot of you accidentally retained memories from previous trials. Like you, Green, you still had memories from the last version when we put you with pinks. <laughs> Crazy, right? Sorry about that. We'll fix it in the next version. Wait! You can change what part we play? Oh yeah, we've had to switch pure hues around from time to time in certain variations of the project. Add a color, remove a color. Especially now that Grey's been... deactivated for good. <laughs> I remember the time we only had reds and blues. 
Oh, the mess. Political division ended up tearing the whole experiment apart. Oh, and when we segregated the blacks and whites, so many protests, so many protests. <laughs> well, I digress. We can switch your role around if you want, Pink. Do you really want to make a change? Yes, I do. Thank you.